Welcome back everyone to the next chapter of Bayonetta and we're in heaven. I think God's going to be kind of pissed at us. You know what would be really cool is if he was like, nah, those guys were really bad at their, in their job and I didn't want to fire them, so thanks for that. <laughs> like he was just the most <laughs> forgiving guy ever. <laughs> it's like, by the way, honey, I love your hair. Yeah, honey, you are working at... <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Oh, this looks familiar. See the angels aren't keeping track of their feathers Jesus. again. This is Bayonetta, Jesus is talking to you. You uttered his name <laughs> and he responded. Fear not, for I am the son of God. Oh. <laughs> and I sound like apparently a gay snape. <laughs> yeah, cool thing about this level is that you can kind of see everywhere you're gonna go from here. Which I never noticed before until I looked around, so like the entire level is just in like this big sphere. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, we have seen that clock face before. Yeah, I believe last time we checked it was plummeting down a cliff. <laughs> in the best opening to anything ever. Oh yes. Brings us back to our roots, doesn't it? Oh, totally. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. We're gonna go this way. Let's break open another grave. I kind of wonder what graves these are because in the real world they're witch graves, but they're completely golden. So are they like Lumen Sage graves? So did that mean that we just got a broken sage heart? Mm. Oh goody again! Hey, it's the bandards! Whoa. Oh, I actually avoided that laser this time. Usually that always hits me, even after I dodge it as you've seen in previous episodes. <laughs> Kick its ass. Kick its ass and take its keyblade. There we are. I am the one who will open the door. Too awesome! <laughs> Seriously, I just sliced two of them in half at once. I would say that's pretty awesome. Oh yeah, Sora only wishes he could do that. Maybe he will, we don't know much about Kingdom Hearts 3 yet. Except for the fact that it exists, which I'm very happy about. Oh yes, I cannot wait for that. Yeah, Final Fantasy XV needs to come first though. But both games are going to be awesome because they're being made by Tetsuya Nomura, so... Well, the Kingdom Hearts team, I should say. Alfheim! Which one is this again? Um. I can't remember what order there is, what order they're in, but uh, well, let's find out. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's just out of body. That's not too bad. Oh, um, I don't remember ever doing this one. Yeah, I do not remember doing that one because that's weird. Yeah, you basically just have to like not be in your body to attack enemies, and then make sure they don't hurt you. It's a lot easier if you have the Gears of Despair, because then all the enemies will automatically go towards you and not your body. But I don't have that, because I didn't buy it at Rodan's shop, so I'll just have to make do. Oh! Oh, okay, so... Oh, so, okay, so it is like a shadow game. Nerd <laughs> 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 back off! Well, it, well, given how Bayonetta works in the shadows, she might have like played loads of shadow games just for fun when she was growing up. I mean, what, 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 are the, what do the Umbra Witches do for fun? Shadow games! <laughs> except, like, except like the cool kind of shadow games, not like the everything is a card game kind of shadow game. I'm going to beat the shit out of all this. I really wish that they were in full color though, because it makes it hard to see them. Yeah. That's why the Gears of Despair is better, because it turns them orange, so you can easily see where they are. But, I don't have I guess that. I don't have enough halos for that. I didn't at the time, I spent it all on techniques and getting other stuff. Badass! Mm -hmm. yeah, I, like that I like that technique, it's just kind of like, I'm going to twirl around on the floor and then just do a massive uppercut. And then kick you with a stiletto. <laughs> That's, that's literally just how you do it. I mean, the main problem with this one is that the enemies don't usually like uh, 
Okay, sometimes they'll get knocked back, but in this one, for some reason, they seem to, like, resist being hit quite a lot, and I'm not really sure why. Hmm. Again, it's not too difficult, because they're kind of like the most basic angels. They're not, like, grace and glory or anything, because that's just too cheap. That would just be unfair. I can't remember if that's if that if they appear on hard mode or infinite climax, because they, they change up the enemies as soon as you go into hard mode, so, like, it's not always set out the same. So I genuinely don't know, but I think this is the last guy. Whoa! Whoa! I didn't mean to do that. Ow! Hey, back off, bitch! I, I was trying to, I was trying to shoot him. I was trying to shoot him, but I got too close and ended up pressing square when I didn't want to. I'm to say, no one said you could touch my booty. <laughs> I'll waggle it in your face, but you can't touch. <laughs> I still got gold. Girls, all she's fine. gotten more in their face. Well, she's got everything. She could just flaunt. Like, oh yes. I don't know. My I boots are custom made. Oh, I want them. Too bad. Sorry. <laughs> Work it, man. I know. All right, where are we going next? Oh yeah, there's a thing back here. Again, secrets are always good. Yay for in-game secrets! This wall would break, Jesus. There we go. We are one step closer to Kilgar. Oh yes, and then the madness will ensue. <laughs> or, at or at least we'll show off what madness could ensue if we used it, because it's kind of game breaking. <laughs> uh, yeah, that just... <sighs> we'll get there eventually. I never could use the panther, it just, it seemed too much like Dark Jack, it's way too hard to control. It's not too hard to control, it just takes like a little bit to get used to, and because like I've sunk like over 80 hours into this game, I kind of know how everything works <laughs> quite well. <laughs> I just didn't, I didn't like the panther sections unless I just had to go in a straight line. Yeah. I mean there's a bit later on here where you have to like kind of do turns and it's a bit awkward, but yeah. it's not too bad. Give me your key, bitch! Wait, where'd he go? I am the true Keyblade Wielder! Being <laughs> be a Keyblade Wielder is the best thing ever. What would her Keyblade look like? I think it just like a really stylized version of her guns, honestly. Oh. Well, you definitely have a Scarborough Fair as the keychain. Oh yeah, oh actually, oh, it would be better if you had one of Scarborough Fair's chains on it. Like, just one that's from the gun. Yeah. Because there's, they've got, like, multiple charms hanging off them. Or if it was, like, one of her uh, medallions in her sleeves. Well, I think and that should be a different Keyblade altogether. Just call that one, like, Umbran Witch, and then, uh... And then and one the one, one with Scarborough Fair is, like, Ruby Death or something like that. <laughs> or just, it could just be called Scarborough Fair. Oh, the ideas fans get. <laughs> oh, yes. It'd be like the most Banff Keyblade ever, ultimate weapon, kiss my ass. Yeah, it'd be like more powerful than the ultimate weapon by like six points. Oh yeah. But it'd also be the hardest to obtain. Like, yeah. you have to beat every boss without dying once. I think I think it'd be like a fun little gimmick where if the Keyblade was not wielded by, wielded by somebody who was like sassy, it would just be like, nope. <laughs> like, sorry, like, Sora. Where it's like, your badass levels aren't high enough to wield this. <laughs> Like, you are once again the messenger boy, and ooh, this is very pretty. Does mind if I hang on to it? It's like, hey, give that back! But, but it's a keyblade! I, only I can wield the keyblade! Yeah, it's quite funny because in like, the official description of like what Bayonetta can do, the fact that she's mastered the bullet arts means that she's pretty much proficient in any weapon that she picks up ever. Which is why that like she can just get a sword and go, oh yeah, I'm awesome with this now. Like, Because that, that's just how she rolls. <laughs> Oh yeah, I just love how when you did when for just I don't know why, but the sky turned into outer space and it was amazing. Yeah, that was like that was like super witch time. That was like because I dodged an attack as well as that thing at the same time. I think I did that it was weird. Pure platinum. Pure platinum. Pure platinum. <laughs> it's fun to say pure platinum. 
Right, now let us dance sensually. Like let us twirl upon the pole. Yeah, you wouldn't think that heaven, like God, would look kind of this. Uh, no sultry behavior in this realm. It's like, like no oh, so. Ooh, um, it's like, it's like, oh, bugger off. <laughs> never mind. He goes, oh shit, I'm <laughs> not messing with her, fuck. <laughs> like, screw that shit, I'm out. Oh, you big I, I dumb ball! Like I kind of like the things like no sultry behavior. What is? Ooh, pretty. Oh my! <laughs> well, that's okay. why she was kind of like, like with the angels when she was just like, "You've been cheating on me, haven't you?" No, no, I swear I haven't. No, no, <laughs> I love the angels. Uh, it was great because maybe they thought like, "I don't want to cheat on her. She could like, 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 like me or something. I don't know." And then, Wait, she, then she, she like she likes them to the me. Wall. She she really likes me. Oh god. <laughs> yeah. You've been cheating on me, haven't you? What? I was with that? Holy shit! Like whoa. My friends are I never gonna believe this. Um... <laughs> and then he realizes his mistake when she punts him into a wall. Fuck. Like oh damn. Oh, uh, are you flat? Yeah, I turned flat. <laughs> I, I did I did Looney Tunes, that's how great Bayonetta is. <laughs> oh, I love it. Cartoon antics. Yeah. Have you ever seen that before? No, I've never seen that before. I've, I've actually never gotten hit by that ball before. Yeah. I don't usually, but then it was like, fuck. <laughs> yeah, I'll get hit by the shockwave, but never by the ball itself. Yeah. If you do in any situation, then it will just like flatten you. It's quite funny. <laughs> Alright, let's deal with you quite quickly. I like how I've just got bits of a key flying around me, like, surely I could, like, you know, stab them with it. Like, take that sun bit and just throw it like a ninja star. <laughs> ninja Straight into star his face. Ninja star. You know what? There's no, there's no reason why she couldn't. She's pretty much done everything by this point. <laughs> I'm about to say, the whole world would have been screwed if Bayonetta had been the one to command the Shadow Games. Yeah, she'll, she'll just like made everyone die and go, <laughs> Like, you annoy me, and it's funny to watch you dance. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. I was kind of lucky, because usually he fires a fireball off screen where I can't see him, so thanks for that. I'm about to say, yes, hold open that mouth so I can put my gun in it and shoot you. Heck, I did it to Fortitudo, and look how that turned out. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, did that happen? Like when I fought 42, if you like get chomped by him, there's like an extra bit you do where you just fire your gun into his mouth. Ah! Uh, no, 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 no! Don't remember. I think you did that. I'm not sure. I have to go back and rewatch it. Okay. Well, even if not, it's worth mentioning because it's like if you just if you like get hit by one of his heads and get grabbed, then she does like a little thing where it's like waggle the stick and then shoot bullets into his open mouth and it's pretty cool. I think if I ever get a black cat I will name her Bayonetta. <laughs> <laughs> I I would have no problem with that. Oh no, it's like have just this the slot the sleekest, most I don't give a shit looking cat you'd ever find. Yeah and then that yeah that's Bayonetta. Like this is Bayonetta. <laughs> She's my kitty. <laughs> have like a red collar and everything. Oh, no, you have to make the collar so it looks like her ribbon, so it's actually got Bayonetta and Demon script on it and stuff. <laughs> I'd have to really look at that and, like, have to be really proficient with a Sharpie. Oh, maybe I could find, well, maybe I could find like, a golden bell to be, like, her medallion. You'll have to tell me on the next episode where we go fight the worst enemies in the entire game.